Hello, it's Jude here and time for some quiet calm. Time to pause, time to breathe and time today to go on a journey. So let me allow you to become comfortable, make sure that there's nothing you need to be concentrating on. Turn your phone down, turn the telly off, the radio and let's just focus on you. And as you look at the screen, you will see an image um, and it's of a hill very, very near where I stay in the village of Newton Moor in the Highlands of Scotland. And it's the hill at the north end of our beautiful village and it's visible from most places that um, you look. And it's called Craig Dew, which means black crag or black hill. And really in this winter's day when this painting was painted, it was a very, very cold, clear sky day. And then the clouds came in and then the sunset. So this painting is called January Sunset. And I can feel the coolness in it as I look. But I was all wrapped up and out getting ideas for this painting. And let me take you on a little journey. You can keep your eyes open or you can close your eyes, whichever you prefer. But let's first of all breathe in that fresh highland air. That lovely air that almost catches your breath as the coolness passes in through your nose and softly breathing out through either your nose or your mouth. And you notice that as you breathe your shoulders open and you notice that there's an opportunity to really pause at each end of your breath. So you breathe in and then you hold a pause for a few counts and then you breathe out. And as you get to the very bottom of your breath, releasing anything at all that you're ready to release in this moment, out into nature. Take that pause before you breathe in again. That's wonderful. Well done. So you notice you're breathing more fully and you can just hear that breeze gently blowing around your head, but you're cosy, you've got a scarf up over your ears. You're lovely and warm and just feeling that breeze on your face. And you can hear a buzzard soaring on high and you look up and there it is and you catch sight of another one swirling on the thermals, flying high, that screeching, squawking sound as they communicate and other perhaps smaller birds flying towards them and they're almost like they're chasing each other. And there's a little battle of the wills going on there in the sky. And you then bring your view to the hill before you. The snow cap painted by the colour of the January sunset. And you know that you may have walked this hill at some point, even in your mind. And there's a winding path at the start that then goes through a forest and then up a bit of bouldering, walking through the heather. And if you go up the hill from the Newton Moor end, before long, you're able to be on a narrow track through the heather and you're able to pause and turn and look back down at the village. And it's mostly hidden in the trees. And the higher you go, the smaller the village seems. 
and it's very quiet up here. Just the birds overhead. Maybe a hare or a rabbit jumping through the heather. And if you're lucky, a deer or a few deer grazing and they stop and they stare. And you look at them and they look at you. And you feel like you're in a wilderness, like you're in a very, very, very remote place. Yet you're only a very short distance from the valley and the village below. And you walk up and you come towards the top of the hill and there seem to be many tops and there are some small cairns. A place for you to pause, to rest and to look across from this hill to the distant hills over towards the Grampian Hills in the Cairngorm National Park. That's right. All around, stunning scenery, tainted with the colours of winter, the blues and the purples, and you're all lovely and warm. So allowing yourself to know that you can visit this place at any time, any time at all, and you let your breath continue to be lovely and soft and long. And slowly, you're making your way back down to the village. Down the path, through the forest, onto the wide track, and enjoying the downward pace of coming back into the village where you began. And you could stay in this deeply relaxed state, you may even drift off to sleep and that's fine. Or allow yourself to come back into the room you began. Perhaps focus your eyes on the lovely Craig Do where you've been on your journey today. I wish you a beautiful rest of day, may you be well, may you be happy and may all good things come to you. And it's bye from Jude Cheese.